ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. It's time! YouTube salute. Canelo Alvarez defeats Sergey Kovalev. He knocked him out in round 11. Man, man, man. Congratulations to Canelo for becoming a four-weight division champion. 154, super welterweight, 160, middleweight, 168, the regular WA um, super middleweight champion, and now the WBO light heavyweight champion. Let's break this fight down, shall we? So in the first round, in the, yeah, Kovalev came out using his jab, flickering his jab, not putting enough mustard on the hot dog, but he was just trying to keep the jab in Canelo's face, trying to stay busy, trying to stay busy, trying to stay busy. Round two and three, Kovalev doing the same thing. Alvarez just trying to time Kovalev, waiting for the right time to execute um, his right hand. He was waiting for um, Kovalev to throw that left hook, which he did, and he countered with a straight right, which actually didn't hurt Kovalev, but actually kind of, you know, Gave him some respect for Canelo's power. Like, okay, okay, I see what you're doing. So, we know Buddy McGirt said, don't put too much power behind your jab. Just keep busy. Conserve your energy and use your jab efficiently throughout the fight so we can stay in the fight, so we can look good on a judge's scorecard. You can look busy. Did it work? It worked somewhat. It was making him look busy, but I'm not going to say it was making Kovalev win. Canelo actually start to pick up the pace in round three all the way to like round seven i think round eight was like a dead um uh, round which nobody really wasn't doing nothing and everybody in the um the stadium arena started booing round nine and ten i saw the unofficial judge gave the rounds to Kovalev, which was kind of weird because on my scorecard i had a seven rounds to three going in to the 11th round for canelo but in round 11, I think Canelo and his team already knew Kovalev was weak. They knew that he was going to uh, fatigue in the second half of the fight because that's Kovalev. That's who usually how he, um, he's he been a type of fighter ever since Andre Ward exposed him. He doesn't have the same type of punching power and the same type of accuracy and precise um, punches in the second half of the fight. So Canelo... Everything was sharper and crispier for him. So all he did was use a chopping left hook, and he followed up with a straight right. And ta-da, Kovalev went down like Frankenstein, Igor the dummy. Ass was on the ground. I was laughing my ass off. I thought this fight would go all 12 rounds. I thought Canelo would win by a unanimous decision, but shit, he won by a KO. So he did his thing. So congratulations to Canelo Alvarez for, for now. He's the new WBO light heavyweight champion. He said in the um, after the fight, he doesn't care about fighting Triple G because he already went 24 rounds with him. He wants to honor the Day of the Dead, which is, you know, All Souls Day. And he didn't care about talking about who he will fight next. I believe and I think that Canelo... If he's still chasing greatness and legacy, which I know he's trying to, he should fight Demetrius Bubu Andrade. He has the WBO middleweight title. He can fight the Charlo at middleweight. He has the WBC title since Canelo has been elevated to the WBC franchise middleweight um, champion now, whatever you want to call that stupid shit they gave him. Or he should stay at light heavyweight and fight another... Um, Light heavyweight champion up there. I mean, he has, you know, options. Is Canelo the number one pound for pound fighter in the world? Not to me. Only because he has an asterisk to, um, next to his name because of the two times he was caught using Kabluterol in his system. So having a Kabluterol, steak tacos, uh-uh, Captain. You're not going to cut it. Not at all. But um, you let me know what you think what Canelo should do next. Should he fight? Kovalev, I mean, excuse me, not Kovalev. Should he fight at light heavyweight, another champion? Or should he fight, go back down to uh, middleweight? Let me know. 
Post your comments below. Hulk smash Black Panther the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. If you'd like to support and donate to the channel, I have Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Stream Apps. Everything's in the description. Until next time.